Coach, we talked about the team showing signs of maturity and growing. What did you see from your team when the Suns cut it to five, called the timeout, and you guys went on a run in that third quarter? Yeah, that, you know, Mike, I think it was like we're, we're growing up in terms of our physicality on the defensive end. I thought we, uh, you know, teams are going to make a run in this league. That's a talented team. Uh, we, we, I think we... Uh, uh, we took it calmly. Uh, we didn't panic. We knew there was going to run, a run was going to be made, and, and uh, you know, got out and got some stops. And then, you know, the ball started going in in the basket a little bit. But uh, really pleased with our physicality on, on the defensive end. What, what's been the biggest difference in your growth there on the defensive side of the ball? Yeah, we're just more active. These past two games, you know, they had 20, 20 turnovers tonight. You know, we talked about that in the off season, improving our activity. Uh, but again, I think that's, you know, that's our mental maturation. I think it's our physical maturation. I, th I think both of those things. I thought Ed Davis was outstanding. I thought, you know, he's a physical player, so sometimes that's contagious. But he was, uh, he was excellent. When you, uh, I mean, when you're hitting, even on the offensive glass, and getting second chance points, uh, being physical on both ends of the court. I mean. I guess just how encouraging is that for you going forward? I and mean, physicality shouldn't go into a slump. Yeah, no, that's great because we were nine for 36 from three, Brian. So, you know, that one sequence in the first half, Alan Crabb misses a three, chases down. I think we get two or three offensive rebounds. We end up kicking it out. And I think it's a Joe Harris corner three. So, uh, you know, again, it's it's that uh, you're not you're gonna have nights where you don't shoot it well in this league, and and uh, we did all the other things to, to you know, help help push through. About the job Karras did in making in making Devin Booker work on yeah. defense, but also making Devin Booker work when he was on offense. So I, I think the advantage we had, we had Karras on him, and then Spencer came in in relief. So we we had two guys to throw at him. I thought they both were excellent. Karras was. Superb on both ends, but I thought Spencer also, uh, you know, came in in relief, and that's tough when you got two kind of six, 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 seven guys that can that can defend the ball like that. It's a it's a huge advantage for us. You had a couple of spots uh, where they cut it to five in the third quarter, and you responded, and then they cut it to ten early in the fourth, and you responded. You think they're growing a little bit of uh, confidence and yeah. maturity right there? Yeah, no, I think in the past we might have, you know, we might have could have folded in, in a, a situation like that. So, um, you know, again, I think it's 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 we're a maturing team. We're, we're getting, you know, mentally tougher and especially on the road that can that can go away quickly, a lead like that. So it's it, you never feel safe. So um, just just I see our, our guys growing in that, that aspect. It's encouraging. It's not. As an example, the rebounding isn't just coming from the rebounders. I mean, you talk all the time about guard rebounding. There was one Shabazz went up yeah. and got I, one. And listen, we I, I, we can't emphasize it enough. We've we've done film presentations, analytic presentations. We're just trying to get them to understand how important it is because our effective field goal percentage defense we're top ten in the league. So we we teams don't shoot well against us. That's that's the truth, you know, right now and and. Uh, we really got to, you know, plug plug that rebounding thing. It's 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 huge. So I thought everyone was thrusting back tonight. We're going to need the guard rebounds, and of, of course, having Ed Davis get 13 rebounds doesn't doesn't hurt either. I said you were asked this before I got here, but That's okay. but just. Uh, uh, as far as the turnovers, the activity that it yeah. shows, it carried over from Philadelphia. And do you think that it's, it's kind of sunk in, that the message is sunk in with these guys? Yeah, I mean, I'd love that to be our identity a little bit, you know, with the speed and, and youth. You know, I, I think we're stronger. We're stronger physically. I think that helps a little. And, and uh, I think we also trust our back line. You know, I think we trust Jared Allen. We trust Ed Davis to protect the rim. So that, that allows us to be a little more aggressive.